walking about sweating your bag off so plan of action today um, we got full eight hours sleeping which i'm absolutely on the moon about um, we're gonna have a walk up to paris now get a lira caesar's card and see if we get any free play with that then we're gonna have a walk down to casino royale um, we'll see if we can get a bit of free play there because we're not members there and then we just kind of a wander this morning before heading towards MGM Grand at dinner time for a buffet which we got a 2 for 1 voucher on my Vegas so looking forward to that and then just about to get them over um, and then after that we've um, got an afternoon round pool I think this afternoon so we can find out what else are um, or I've got what else interesting to show you you so we've just nipped into Caesars, uh, that's a lie, we've just nipped into Paris because we are going to get um, a little, go on, Caesars rewards card. But I just want to like put on special mention that I, 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 tell you, I don't know what it is about this hotel, I absolutely love the theming of it. I mean, I think it just looks wicked. I mean, we're not really Caesar property people. Um, I don't really know why, to be honest, because half of strip Caesars, but there's just something about this one hotel that I really, really love. I said to Aaliyah that um, I wouldn't mind stopping here, to be honest. I've seen uh, seen some of the rooms that have been re re renovated and they look wicked. Um, but yeah, I really like this hotel. It's one of my favourite ones. So I'm just going to find somewhere to get a coffee now and then... Uh, Get Leo's card in a little while. So catch in a bit. So we've just got, uh, well, we were going to get a coffee in Paris. Um, I got this in a Tropicana number, and Leo got herself uh, an ice. Uh, well, it's like a cold coffee in it. Um, and just to anyone that's thinking that's not been to Vegas before, oh, how much is it? 17 quid. No, 16 dollars. Oh, well, what's that then? About 40, 30, uh, 40 Yeah, something like that. But pretty as well, it's mega expensive. Um, I mean, obviously, we would come last year so we know what it's like. But And anyone that's watching that's been to Vegas before will know what it's like. But it, anyone that had it is so expensive just for your basics. But, just uh, heading towards um, MGM desk now. I think that were called Brioche by Guy Savoy, I think, yeah. So that's where we got these from. So this is really nice. She says it's really nice, but would you pay eight pound that in Rotherham? Probably not. So yeah, I'm gonna head to Caesar's desk now when it happens, and then have a walk on down, down to Pub Strip to uh, Casino Royale, so catch you guys. So, just an update, everyone. Um, while we were waiting for Caesar's desk to open, we stuck, um, we had like five ones, I think it were. We stuck it in um, roulette, won a couple of times, so we're cashing that out. Um, and then we have got Alia's, um, she's now signed up to Caesar's uh, over to the dark side. And the promotion they had out at the time was either $10 free play or a free cocktail. Uh, obviously we opted for the free play, so we're going to find somewhere to bang this in. Probably not going to get anything for it, but you never know, do you? Only takes one spin. So we're going to bang, bang this in and then have a one further up trip. So catch you in a bit, guys. So roll, uh, low rolling, we are $10 free play at 50 cent, and she's got a little flag bonus. Anything is a bonus, so let's see if we can get out. That. Oh yeah, that queen action. Eight dollar fifty. Balls. Wild. It's really quiet here this morning. 
I mean, what I will say is, what I have noticed on the re-trigger, what I have noticed from Paris is there's not as uh, much of a, a slot selection as there is in like MGM. Um, but I do love it here, like I said earlier on. So, as you can see, uh, $11.20, cheeky little win off 57. Just an update guys, if you can hear me, look at all the lights that they've put up. Because obviously Vegas is going to be a night race, um, so all the lights are now getting installed. You can see it all the way down there. And you won't be able to see the grandson they're putting in a minute, but basically, I mean, that side of the road's walkway is still open. But over near the Bellagio, you can't walk in front of that. And it's the same up near Horseshoe as they're building Blake Shelton's The Old Red Bar which will be wicked to be fair and I'll be interested and uh, looking forward to doing that next year when we come back um, so yeah just making his way down to Casino Royale now so I'll let you know when we get there so guys come to Casino Royale we've took advantage of the um, $20 in and if it loses the credit your account with $20 so as machine of choice it's a little shop of horrors. So let's see if we can turn this $20 into one. So just a little update. I've been through my 20 and I've been through my 20 free play, um, which automatically gets added to your account. Oh, something's happening. Would you believe that? What is going off here? Almost oh, some wild action. You have to use the 20 then before. Yeah, I have to use. Yeah, yeah, you do. So you have to use the latest 20, big, big load, 2190 there. So yeah, you have to use your, uh, your 20 before you get your 23 player. So just on the layers now. So everyone, just an update. Um, we've just done a free player slash $20 in and all that. Um, didn't get onto bonus, which we wanted to play in Fox. We've seen loads of other people's vlogs and um, it looks wicked. So we didn't get that unfortunately, but what we did get is we got a line in. I mean, Anyone that's played Rocky Horror before will know what I'm saying here, but like that's the first time that we've played it, and then it, it, it does like really quiet and um, then chucks um, a character up at you, like Seymour come up and he were on for $600, and I thought, oh my god, it's going to spin in. You know, he's come up, but he never. There were four of him, we got teased. But we won a $31 hit with one of the jackpots, and so the 20 that Aaliyah put in, uh, we've got out. So Alia had her $20 and spun $23 and we got $20 out. Um, I spun my $20, spun me $3 and got nothing out. So from that, uh, we've, it's cost us $40. We've gone through $80 player and we've got 20 back. So it's cost us $20. So all in all, not too shabby. So we're gonna, gonna head on back downstream now towards MGM and somewhere along the line we will call in somewhere else. We'll let you just update you as well, we've just walked past, past, back past that machine that we just played on and someone's got a fucking jackpot here about literally 30 seconds. Unbelievable the chat. So we're just in It's Sugar which is just next to Link Promenade and we're just looking and they've got all sorts of stuff. Um, I really like this three strike candy uh, they've got like artificially burgers i mean i cannot put into context how heavy this gummy bear is like it's a basic I bet it's a good five kilogram it's just pure like gummy bear it's not wrong it's 40 quid like they've got um giant worms gummy pizzas a giant shark that's 30 dollars um pineapple sorry watermelon and breakfast uh, it's a cool little shop list, they've got all sorts. Um, obviously, as you can imagine, American sweet treats. Um, they've got some cool little pillars here as well. So, yeah, we'll probably come back here towards the end of the week and get a little bit of candy and take it home. So, I just thought I'd let you know. So, it's not where you have the alcoholic drinks, the sugar place. It's called It's Sugar, and it's just off. Um, it's, in, it's just in front of Horse, you know. The
So, just for another because we like to check out all those merch and everything. And to all our people that uh, we love Orlando, look at these. They are so so they're very the pretty much the same as Starbucks. How much are they? $25. Twenty five dollars bargain. Because in um, Disney you're paying $50, aren't you, for yeah, them? Yeah, well, I think, is it Eleanor Adventures? She got one. I don't know if it was, um, Steve got the one that was, was it Shiny or Matt? Uh, no, I think it was Matt Black as but well. I'm sure he paid like $50. Yeah, $50. I mean, it's Starbucks, but literally it looks the same. Well, pretty much exactly the same, yeah. Um, I'm trying not to get a copyright strike in here, but if I do, I do. Um, just keep talking. <laughs> but it, yeah, I know, right, but just look at this. Well, that's a sick top as well. Some of these merch are quality. So yeah, just having a nosy around here. Yeah. Let's see what else I found to sell, let you know. Just an update, we found some more. They are a bit extra. And these are $39. They're nice then. But also as well, for any of you pin collectors, I mean, I'm not really a pin collector, but um, we've got loads of pins on back all here. I think they're about, I think it's $15. Let's have a look. Yeah, $14.50. So, yeah, loads of cool stuff in here, guys. Pretty wicked shop. So, guys, we've just come into the Coca-Cola store. Um, there was some pretty wicked merch in um, Hard Rock shop. Um, loads of them, uh, what they call them, earlier, them like Starbucks, like typing mug, um, coffee glasses or coffee cups, but they're so much cheaper um, than in Orlando and than Starbucks. So uh, yeah, just having a nosy around here as well. I think as uh, as we've watched more and more people's vlogs, we've turned into like merch shoppers because we just love looking at merch as everybody else does. We just don't buy it. We just don't buy it because we spend as money. Like a lounge floor. Oh yeah, look. Cook, cook, go the rip off lounge floor. So yeah, see what else in here. We will let you know, but it's all pretty wicked. I might have to get a pillow or two from Las Vegas for me and you surf bed in my gaming room. I mean, if there's ever a pillar that sums me up, it's a bottle of Fanta. Matches your hair. <laughs> what a knobhead. <laughs> so, right, we're going to have a mooch around in here, guys. Um, if we see what else, I will let you know. But after that, we are then heading to MGM Grand for the buffet. Two for one on Mike Vegas Rewards. So, we'll see you there, guys. So, guys, I did tell you we'd let you know if we found out else. And look at this. If anybody that knows me in real life will know that I've never, ever, ever in my 30 years of existence lost a game of Monopoly. And there's another board here. Could it be added to the collection? Could it be not? Find out. Stay tuned with Matthew. In all honesty, we're looking around to see if we can find that Coca Cola machine where you can try them all. Uh, but I'm not sure if I've got one in here, but if they have, we'll let you know. So, catch you about. So, we have found it, guys. This is Around the World Soda Tray. Uh, music the Soda Fountain on the second floor. So, guess where we're going? Second floor. We'll see you all there, guys. So, guys, we found the Soda Fountain. Um, as you can see, I'll see if I can zoom in. It is $15, I think. With our float tray. Oh, float tray. So, so the Around the World Tray is $16. Yeah, so you can see it's $16 and a floor tray is $15, so you're looking at $25 in combo combination. I mean, we're not going to do it today, but we might come back and do it at a different point. Problem is, I might not drink it all. So, I mean, I can see they've got Coca Cola, they've got Fanta, oh, let me zoom out. They've got Fanta Melon here as well. What other Coca Colas have we got? Can you see? Um, if I get a picture of them, I'll let you know, guys, but if not, that is where it is. So it's on the second floor in Coca-Cola Worlds in Las Vegas. Next to Denny's, may I add. So that's where it is. Oh, my God. Claire Furmage, number two. She has sniffed out a little Christmas section. What is it? Fucking Santa, we a bottle of Coke. Santa, we a bottle of Coke. She's buzzing over that. I'm not I mean, buzzing for $25. She's not that buzzing for $25. But we've got Santa Gonks. So we've got all sorts going off here. I mean, granted, it's not a massive uh, Christmas section, but they do have one if you want. I mean, that's a pretty cool. Um, that's a pretty cool ornament to have up at Christmas. Santa, Santa, a vending machine. So yeah, guys, that is the Coca-Cola store. So unless we pass any more shops on way, next time you'll see us will be in Gem Grand Buffet. MGM 
ATM uh, ground up there. On the, the right hand side, you've got all your breakfast stuff. Some fruits as well here. Don't have that much footage I'm going to get in here because it's quite quite busy up at. Um, yeah, you can do. It's quite busy up near all food. <coughs> so you've got some sushi mussels and clams, all your fish stuff. Um, looks like what we got here. Some Spanish. So you got fajitas there. Um, barbecue pork, pork gravy, and um, some catfish puddies. Bit of pizza, um, and then that's about it, guys. So. Yeah, that's what's on at dinner at the MGM Grand Buffet. So, at the MGM Grand Buffet, Brammer's Beige Bites section is a bit of beef brisket, a bit of roast turkey, no, roast chicken, turkey, and some potato hash browns. I think that's brisket. Well, yeah, I've got some bacon, sausage, scrambled egg, turkey, and beef brisket. Um, one thing I will say, I mean, for me as a picky eater, there's not a massive selection, but for anyone else, there's enough. Um, I don't but, think I'd but, pay full price for two people. No, I don't think I'd pay 30, $30 each for this, if I'm honest with you. I'd rather have an ATVs again. Um, but what I will say is the beverages, they've literally got anything you can think of. They've got any any type of Fanta, different flavours of Coke, Minute Maid, Dr Pepper, all sorts. And that's only $21 for unlimited. And, and yeah, and then you've got a bar over in corner. Um, there's 21 dollars for unlimited beers and everything so you know it, it, it's, i would say it's cheap and cheerful uh, but I, I certainly won't pay 30 dollars each for me but again each to their own um, so this is buffet number one for the week ticked off once we've eaten this so yes that is the mgm grand buffet so we've just come out at mgm grand buffet overall what are your thoughts it's all right yeah it's, it's all right I probably won't do it. I don't think there's that much choice. Yeah, agreed. Um, yeah, she she literally will eat anything, but there isn't that much choice. I mean, the only choice I had was basically carve, carve, uh, what do you call it? Carving station. That were it. Um, so, yeah, my advice would be, unless you've got a two for one, or, I mean, you're ultra not fussy, but even then, I, don't, I just don't think there's enough to warrant paying $30 each. Um, and also, I was saying to Aaliyah, if you pay $30 and then you buy the drinks package as well, you're $110 in. Um, and I just think it's just, put it this way. For two. For, yeah, for two people, but put it this way, I think, I mean, we're not, obviously, very well experienced in Vegas, but you can certainly get wealthy money somewhere else. So we are just heading over to... I don't know, probably New York, New York or something like that. Um, and we're going to do my my mate's um, little group ball thing. So when we get over there, guys, I'll catch you there. See you in a bit. Yeah. <laughs> 
dirty. Lovely. So, my Glamour's assistant will pass me the phone back and as you can see, $50 in. Go with him. $50 in. I'm going to play either 180 or 90 a spin and we will let you know if you get any bonuses. But let's see who does best, Kev. Good luck, love. I will let you know. Right, sorry about that, people. I've uh, just had to compose myself after me minging shot. So I think I might try and uh, do a bit of research on what are nice shots. Or I might put something on a Facebook group to see if anyone's got any recommendations. Because that is hurting on way down. So I told you it's a shot, slot and ramble. So that means it's like almost like a live stream. So if you don't want to watch it, fair enough. But let's go. And also, I can't believe that Kev's picked this game. Well, I can't, that's an actual lie. I can't believe Kev's picked this game because it's one of his favourite games, but... Nope. Yeah, it's just really fine scenario. Go on, I did. Yeah, it is a bit loud. I don't even know how to turn it down on here. Oh, it's got my glamorous assistant turning it down. So, yeah, long story short, we thought we'd do this because in real life, I've actually never met Kev, but we do tend to talk all the time. So we just thought we'd do something and collab. And obviously he's picked me three of the fucking worst possible machines. And I've been very generous to him. Like I said, I'm not going to tell you what I've got. Uh, sorry, what he's got. Oh man, I don't even know what I'm looking for here. purple. Spin. Three spins. Come on, baby. One, two, three. Oh, eight. In the words of Kev, let's come on down to Hyde's. Oh, I don't know which one's which. If anyone wants to let me know in the comments which one's Hyde and which one's Anna. I'm not sure. I'm guessing Hyde is Wonder, but... Oh, Heidi! Oh, here it is. It's the other one. Go on, Heidi. After watching many vlogs on this, I always think that uh, Anna's such a tight bitch. Oh, come on down to Heidi's. Come on, Anna. Unbelievable. Oh, 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 Everyone is so, so there is one right. rule to this. Are you thirsty? Oh, yeah! Thirsty. Look who's joining the fun. Come say hello to Anna. She's here to have some fun. So there is Rather one rule to this. Are you thirsty? Oh my god, Anna keeps interrupting. What the night, eh? Let's have another. Go on then. Now then, let's have a good symbol. Oh, no. I love oh, to play at that I still pick up my accordions and give them a So, massive win of $8, back up to 50 So, before we spin, one rule that I were saying is you've got to have at least 10 spins even if you get a bonus, and I think that will what? So $8 too, so we've done about eight spins. So another couple of spins, and then that is me done, because it's bonus or bust, but it's a minimum of 10 spins. So another couple of spins. One more. Oh my God, that looked really good. Better than it was. So, Mr. Old. No, no, it's a challenge this. I'm not playing it to 50. So, Mr. Alderson, 53.65 on game one. That is my challenge to you. The lovely idea, Nana. Good luck, bro. So guys, chucked a ticket into Chica Bonita. Uh, she didn't really do all for us last night, but we'll see if we can get some out of today. 
I'll come back to you for getting the bonuses. So just a quick update guys, you'll see by what cash is in. We only had a couple of spins and then we'll come off it because we wanted to go on this... Um, uh, what do you call it? Hot stuff. Yeah, is that what it's called? Hot? Yeah, Hot Wheels. Hot stuff or whatever it's called. When it goes, Hot stuff, baby, this evening. And um, there's someone took a seat. Um, just come off it. Unbelievable. Right. I might fucking change the scenes again then. Can't do anything. Hi, guys. As I said, we did get back on this. So, let's see if we can do it on this um, Wicked Wheel or Hot Stuff. Come on, baby. So as you can see, guys, we've switched from the machine, hot stuff. We didn't have no luck on that one. We've uh, popped another twenty dollars in, so we're about twenty dollars down on that. So we're gonna have a go on Corrida with Toros. So see what we get, guys. So guys, we've switched it up, uh, gone on to up and more puff, and we got the wheel feature. So let's see what we get. I mean, I take Mansion again. Don't really want Mini, if I'm honest. Anything but Mini. He's going to be a minute. Long. <laughs> <laughs> fucking dirty bastard. Fucking dirty. Unbelievable scenes. Not, not, not the best. Let's see if we can get another. So one. guys, down to us last 293. I've been moaning all week that we haven't, well I say all week, we've only been here a fucking day. I've been moaning that we haven't had the hat feature, but we have played a decent amount of open more buff. And so uh, let's see what we can get. Hopefully turn it to a good bonus. Come on. Get some re triggers would be nice. Come on, man. Not looking good. No, it's not looking good, is it? <laughs> Unbelievable, girl. Yeah, so it's uh, not playing ball, this machine, is it? I guess $7. Come on Wolf, I need to blow out a miner, even though you can't get it. What are we gonna get? Absolutely charged. Well, I'll try not to spend all that on And I mean, for anyone watching, I mean, I know that we're only betting 75 cents, but I do expect to be more than 650, but never mind, we'll keep going. This will be gone in a second, so I'll catch you when we leave here. Afternoon guys, so as you'll just see, we just had a bit of slot play in MGM Grant, uh, well, that's a lie, in New York, New York. We, um, I did my friend's little uh, group pull, and um, I'll pop some footage in of the bonus. I did uh, live stream it to them guys, but um, yeah, I've only filmed the bonus for the vlog. Um, so we ended up, we had $300 in, $5 a spin, um, apart from mine which was $250 a spin, and we came out with $446, so that's a win, um, $146 profit, happy days. So big shout out to Tim Grayling, Sam Murray, Kev Alderton and Matt Jones, uh, thank you very very much for all chipping in, it's been you know, good laugh. Love to see you all on live stream as well while I'm in Vegas. Um, so yeah, we've just put 50 in in the um, MGM. I said it again. Uh, into New York, New York, and we're probably going to have a walk back up towards Bellagio now. Yeah. So, but I love it in here. It's got a real wicked atmosphere. Um, it's one of my, it's one of my favourite casinos. To be fair, what do you think? You like it in here? Yeah, it's good in there. So. I mean, I know they're in the middle of remodeling um, all rooms as well, so you never know. Obviously, depending on if we're offers we get, we could be stopping here next year. I'm not too sure yet, so yeah, all in all, good afternoon, guys. So, uh, catch you next day.
one more ball that we're going to get. Let's go for some iron. Oh, So stopping in Bellagio, we've just done his way back to Rue, but we've uh, had to call by the uh, gelato shop or whatever you call it, but look at some of these, they look amazing. They've got a, um, I am 99% sure this is where you've got your Caesar salad from, here it is. So they do everything here, um, they've got Lister or ice cream to do as well here, look. I'll let you know, because we're going to get an ice cream, I think, so I'll let you know how much it is. They've also got, um, like, come round slowly. They've got a chocolate fountain here, and it's actual chocolate. I mean, everyone will have seen this, of course, but... All the way up there. So, yeah, going to get an ice cream now. Um, and I will show you what we get when we get round there. Alright guys, so, um, Bellagio Patisserie, we're going to send a chocolate cone, and the lady got herself, show us, uh, summer, what crepe is it? Nutella. Nutella crepe. Um, obviously, charging it to a room standard. Um, get them a tip. <laughs> I mean, I feel so tired because I don't want to give them a tip. Because all they've done is what you do in a shop in England, but it's America in it, so give them a little tip. I mean, $25 is pretty steep. It's big ice cream and it's massive crap. Well, and you're in Bellagio, but it is what it is. So, um, yes, guys, off back to the room now. I'm going to chill out for a bit. Chill out for about half an hour. Get ready for um, um, Mandalay Bay tonight off to Sky Sport Lounge. Go see MJ and then a bit of gambling. So, we will take all the way tonight, guys. Hope you're enjoying it so far as much as we are, because we are absolutely loving it. Had a wicked day today exploring, going through all the shops, a bit of a group over up on that, so yeah, it's been a wicked day, but we'll catch you in a bit. So guys, sorry for not checking in, um, it's been a bit manic, we've been a bit rushed, so um, we've got a booking at 5 o'clock, which is 5 minutes ago, at, Delana, at Skyfall Lounge in Delana, so... We are just heading into the Lano now, so when we get in there, I'll have a bit more of a chat about what we're doing tonight and uh, get some footage to up there. So, yeah, catch you at Skyfall.
uh, we've just come out of Skyfall, how good did you think Skyfall? Really nice actually, just messed with Philip and Yeah, they did. I mean, I'll talk about it more later, but basically, um, we had two drinks each, and she asked Aaliyah, because Aaliyah drinks like a fish, and obviously got massive eyes with Uber, then she wanted a third drink. Um, and basically, um, I think she went on lunch, and then she didn't end up bringing us third drink, but yeah, they bugged us for it, didn't they? Yeah, um, like $15 each. Yeah, $15 each, so we're like, we're not paying that, and then managed to come over and. Uh, Obviously we're a bit tired for time because then we had to go to Luxor to redeem a, um, an MGM voucher to his card and then for my Vegas later on and then we had to get into Michael Jackson but whew, we made it on well. So we're just in queue now, uh, going to get a drink to go into Michael Jackson. I'll see what footage I can get but I'm really looking forward to this one. Um, if I remember rightly we paid about, what, I want to say $18 each. I'm just looking $16 for a fucking drink. How much? How much? So yeah, um, we're going to get a drink to go to Michael Jackson and um, see what footage we'll get guys. So catch you in a bit. guys just in Michael Jackson um, I think guy at bar is absolutely fuming so we've just got a couple of drinks in a Michael Jackson cup I had because uh, we were paying cash he wanted to pay on card and they were like oh click here for a gratu gratuity and I'm like I'm not being funny but um, we are not paying the tips so so sorry I had to go abruptly. Um, as you'll have just seen by the new footage, some lady come up to her, watch her, and she says, Oh, I don't want you to sit so far back. Um, basically they're not that busy tonight, so she's moved us about ten rows forward and oh, um, and the equivalent of them tickets would have been probably about another sixty quid each. So we're now gonna move forward and not had to spend within twenty dollars. Uh, but as I was saying, so the guy he thought we were paying on card, because uh, we were paying cash. He, um, I think he, he said, "Oh, click one of these three buttons for a tip, and it was fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, or other." Um, and I was like, "Obviously, we're paying cash." So we were like, "Right, me, 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 me. got our ass on, get us change, and like, bye." So I was like, "See you, mate. You're not having a fucking tip anyway. Cause all you've done is give me a drink." So. Yeah, just in Michael Jackson, we're going to watch this. She told us we're not allowed to film, so see if I can get a sneaky bit of footage. But if not, then do apologise, but I'll let you know afterwards. Uh, then we're going to go to Public House for some food, aren't we? Which we can't wait. And then um, a bit of gambling, so catch you after the show. So we've just come out of Michael Jackson. What did you think to Michael Jackson? They were really good. Good, weren't it? The <laughs> funny thing is, though, this might make people laugh, right? But Michael Jackson thinking it was like some sort of sick tribute. <laughs> and I knew he said sick just all over, I didn't realise what sick just all over. But it was really so I good. Stage you were sat there like, I'm like, where's what? Michael Jackson coming out? <laughs> then I realised, penny dropped. But um, yeah, so we're just going through what looks on now. Um, we're going to go to Public House, get some food. It's what, half past nine? Quarter nine. Quarter nine. Quarter nine. Just lose track of time. <laughs> so uh, yeah, we're gonna get some food at Public House now. Um, so we'll show you what we get when we're in there. And then we might finish off a bit of gambling for the night and then head back to the room. So uh, yeah, we'll show you what we get to eat and uh, show you what we get up to in a bit. I went for the chicken fingers, but they look, look more like fillets to me. We got some pub fries and what are yours? Boneless wings. Boneless wings. Um, we've got some sort of sauce there. We've got garlic parmesan and lemon pepper. Garlic parmesan, lemon pepper with a few carrots. Uh, 
Yeah, I've got some carrots and some celery sticks and then whatever these sauces are. Um, so yes guys, we're going to crack into this. So guys, we've just come out of public house. Um, it was $62, but we had us 20 quid off for my Vegas reward. So 42 and then tip, so we jumped 55 in all together, which weren't bad at all. It was quite nice, weren't it? Yeah, it was. so much food. Oh, so much food. So... We had to spend $40 to get 20 off, but... If we'd have gone, like, I got 24 boneless wings, we could have shared that even. Oh, yeah. Because I left 11. Yeah, so... We had a lot of chicken tenders and a lot of boneless wings. We had far too much food, to be fair. So we're just going to have a quick gamble in Luxor now and see if we can hit out. So if I do, I'll come back to you. What? It smells of weed. Yeah, it does smell of weed. I feel like I'm off my rocker. You are off your fucking rocker. Right, we'll uh, see what we can find and come back to you guys. So just an update guys, um, we went to sit down on a machine, it didn't work and then we got up to have a look for something else and we just thought, nah, it stinks in here. So we're gonna, and it, it literally is about minus 10. I have never ever ever seen as many people in t uh, trousers and coats, it's mad. I mean it is cold and I have got, uh, got my legs out. So we're having a walk up to Dirty Castle, not to gamble there, just to pass through. Um, and it looks like the elevators are working. So shut the front door. So yeah, having a walk up. We're gonna have a gamble in New York, New York, we've decided. Um, so gonna head up to New York, New York now, and um, we'll, we'll catch up with you when we get up there and see if we can get any uh, bonuses. So catch you in a bit, guys. Right people, change of plan. We are gonna gamble in the dirty castle. Never thought I'd hear me say it and just prove look, the dirty castle. So found enough for more puff and we're gonna get on it. So we'll check it with you. Right guys, uh, $20 in, uh, 75 cents a spin and we are in with a regular hatch bonus. So come on then, let's see if we can get some gold houses. Solid start. Need a few more hats on this, I think. There we go, I'll take a re-trigger that. And a few more filled up. Alright, come on now, we need to hit one. Now, one more. Unbelievable. I'll tell you what, we're not much love with these bonuses on here today, have we? Never mind, people, you can't win them all. Come on, the dirty wolf in the dirty castle. What can you do? Okay, love that. So guys, we've come on happy and prosperous now. Um, we're major of 636. We cashed that other ticket out at 8055 and we we had enough uh, rubbish bonuses on uh, off and more buff for one day. So we're gonna see if one can do on this one. So we'll let you know if we get any bonus. So guys, as you can see, after persevering, we must have done nearly 100 spins. Uh, we're only low rolling at 50 cent. It's been giving us, been telling us, hasn't it? It's been about 15 spins with two bots, 15 spins with five balls, and as you can see, we're a little miner at $50. So let's see what else we can get. Another miner would be nice. That would be nice, but a miner would be better. Come on then, baby. Gonna get a spin. Come on, don't kill us there. Oh, say by the bell. I've seen some big numbers there, uh, flying by, and we've also seen some big numbers in spinning, haven't we? Yeah. So let's, there you go. 
So guys, we uh, we chanced his arm at two fifty ten cent denom. It's Ursus chocolate shot it will do. Um, and to no avail unfortunately. Um, didn't even get a line in. So just weren't to be and we come so close on so many times to so many bonuses tonight. We kept getting two for feature, five um, balls for Oldham spin, but we just didn't get it, so Tomorrow will be another new day, so that's probably going to be all for us tonight. Um, I've got a mega day planned for tomorrow. We've got probably go for breakfast at Rira um, down at Mandalay. We have got uh, Raiders Stadium too, which I can't wait for. And then we've got a bit of, of chilling in the afternoon. I think we're going to get some pool time in, aren't we? Need some sun, and then. Um, <laughs> slot pull part two because we won a bit of money today so everyone's agreed that we're going to go for it again tomorrow um i mean you can't win them all we won all slot pull we're about 160 dollars up betting 250 and five dollars um, and then we've just gone through literally in 10 minutes 150 dollars on 250 a press so by my math that is what 75 presses and didn't even get a sniff so yeah all in all, not a bad day. Taking hundred dollars back to the room so you can't go more than a four hundred and twenty-five budget. So thanks for watching if you're still watching up to this point. Um, got a mega day plan tomorrow as I said and we will catch you all in the morning. See you later.